So when you're fostering a culture of creativity, you know, if I thought about what are the do's and don'ts, do demand and role model curiosity. How does that show up? What are the questions you're asking? Are you creating space for others to ask questions? And are you actually demanding that they ask the questions? Why, how, and really push that agenda? Do design and protect a learning agenda. Uh, and put money aside and protect it with your life to do the work you need to do to go truly learn and take action. Do be disruptive. Uh, step into disruption and assume it's going to happen. Don't wait for it to happen and create the conditions that would make you very uncomfortable and ask the tough questions you don't really want to have to answer and do that as a leadership team. Don't assume that you've got the answers today because you surely don't. Don't assume that the methods uh, that have brought your business to the level of success that you've achieved thus far will continue to work for you. Equally, don't jump the gun and shift. You know, the pendulum doesn't need to go from here to there. For instance, if I think about traditional TV advertising, television is incredibly powerful. Viewership is very robust. Is it dropping off? Surely it is. Is it moving to other media? Absolutely. But in some places, we are seeing people jump from one side of that page all the way to the other, and we think that's a huge error. Got to make, it's all about intelligent reach. So are you driving an intelligent reach model in totality, which combines traditional with emerging new media?